Welcome to the Eaton Family Thunderdrome. It's Street Race Outlaws time. Meet 2, Season 8. The story of Meet 1 was a good story. A surprising story. The defending grand champion didn't make the final. The Evo. We had two rookies make their first appearance. The Torque Twister and the Lancia Delta Integrale. And they did fine. But the main story was the, the former grand champion, the 350Z. He took honor. He took the win. He beat out in second place the Grand Sport Corvette. So the two veterans fighting it out, starting the season off well. Let's see if the 350Z can repeat the meet result today. So in lane one, we have the Grand Sport Corvette, legend of the league, 25 career wins, currently sitting in second. Lane two, former grand champion, Leading the competition at the moment, the Nissan 350Z. Lane 3, we have the 84 Audi Sport Quattro. Four career wins, currently sitting in fifth position. Lane 4, we have Torque Twister, the rookie. One career win, sitting in fourth. And lane 5, yet another rookie, the Lancia Delta Integrale. One win, currently sitting in third. Favorite to win is the 350Z. The two legends are battling out each other again this meet. Who comes out on top? Can one of the rookies come from behind? Let's find out. Good race, and he's onto the flat. Talk this is right there with him. Grand Sport Corvette is motoring up on the outside in lane one, and he takes the win, knocking out the others, taking revenge into the championship race. Payback is sweet for the Grand Sport Corvette, knocking out the 350Z. All he's got to do now is win the whole damn thing. Race two. Well, we had 62 career wins between the first five. Just 16 for these. Which isn't surprising. We've got uh, two rookies and intermediate. So in lane one, we have the Nissan Silvia. Seven career wins. His second stint in Street Race Outlaws. He's struggling a bit. First meet of the year. He came last in his preliminary race. Lane 2, the rookie. This is his second meet. The MST Suzuka. He finished fourth in his preliminary round race. He's a fine looking car. I love the artwork. Lane 3, two career wins. This is the Subaru Impreza Police Special. His preliminary round race, he finished fourth. Lane four, rookie Tesla, Model X. Had an uninspiring start to his street race outlaw career, running dead last. And lane five, race favorite, we have the 01 Acura Integra. Seven career wins, and he finished third in his preliminary round race. So it's a good thing all these guys hitting each other up in the second meet. They're going to get some points here. They don't, and they don't have to do it against any big competition. Let's see if the Integra can do it. He's a favorite and he should. Good start by everyone. Integra leads in five. Tesla's dropping back. Police Special up the middle has taken the win. Sylvia came up late to grab third. Impreza first, Tegra second. 
The Impreza makes it through to the championship race, and it's a minor, minor upset. The Integra and the Sylvia do it all the time. They've got all the wins on the board, seven apiece. And when they're up against the uh, lower-ranked cars and they're looking like they're favourites, they bomb out. <laughs> Brings us to race three. Just 12 career wins between these five cars. We do have two top 10 cars from last season. And we've got a rookie. Uh, so in lane one, 2015 custom Ford Mustang. Isn't he a beaut? Eight career wins. He only made it to the preliminary round and he finished third. He is the equal favorite and he is a top 10 car, finishing eighth last season. Lane two, the rookie, all eyes are on him. Another escort, the 1970 model. He is great looking. However, he finished last in his preliminary race. Rather disappointing. Lane three, we have the Nissan Leaf Nismo. He finished ninth last season, top 10 car. He made it third in his preliminary round race. He is equal favorite with the Mustang. He looks good. Lane four, we have the returning Subaru WRX STI. One career win and his first race back, finished fourth. And lane five, we have the 2010 Infiniti G37. Lucky to be here. Won the last race of the last meet of the last season to remain here. And he did all right in his preliminary round. He finished third. Can he do better? I believe it's between the Nismo and the Mustang. Let's find out for sure. Another good race, Escort leads in two, Mustang's chasing hard, but the Escort's running away from him. The Escort wins his first race in Street Race Outlaws, beating the Mustang and the Nismo. Now that was a surprise, a big surprise and upset. Didn't look that convincing in the first meet, but he comes out and beats two top 10 cars in the Mustang and the Leaf Nismo. The Escort is in the big dance. Race four, 102 career wins between these five guys. This is a good standard race. In lane one, we have the Ford Mustang Mark E. Six career wins. Didn't make it out of the preliminary rounds last meet. Finished third. Lane two, a former grand champion, the Camaro Special. Top 10 car, he finished second last season. 22 career wins. Didn't get out of the preliminaries. Placed second. Lane three, we have the Subaru WRX STI. A rookie, his first meet, he came oh so close to getting into the championship race, running second in the preliminary round. Let's see if he can go one better. He's up against it today, against the Camaro. Lane four, we have a veteran of the league, the Datsun 510 wagon, 19 career wins. Had a dismal start finishing fourth in his preliminary round race. And lane five, the race favorite, the defending grand champion, he's five times grand champion. It's the Mitsubishi Lancer Evo. 55 career wins. And he ran second in his preliminary round. He'll be eager to go one better. And I think the only one who can stop him is the Camaro special. Let's see if he's up to it today. He already took that first, he's leading in lane five. The Dotson's right after him, and they're head to head now. It's gonna be close. It's a photo finish. 
It's the Datsun! The Datsun upsets everyone! <laughs> what a legend! <laughs> oh, wow, man. What an upset. The 510 Wagon pulls up his 20th victory going into legendary status and doing it by beating the top two cars in the league in the Evo and the Camaro Special. What a way to bring up 20. My man, I'm putting all my money on him to win the whole damn thing. <laughs> Race 5, last of the preliminary rounds. 75 career wins between these guys. In lane 1, we have another legend of the league. The Subaru Impreza, 21 career wins. Didn't make it out of the preliminaries. Last meet, finishing 4th. Whoa, bummer man. Lane two, check out this sweet ride. This is a beauty, the Subaru SVX. Gorgeous car. Bad, bad start, finished last. Let's see if he can do better. He's up against it though, because in lane three, well, we got the race favorite. Mm -mm. That's the 70 Ford Escort. Top 10 car, finished fourth last season. In his preliminary round, he finished second. In lane four, we have the 70 Ford Capri. Also, similar story to the SVX. Finishing last in his preliminary round race. Rather disappointing. He had so much promise coming from from Street Wars. And lane five. Oh, legends galore. Here we go, another legend of the league. It's the 2015 Jaguar F-Type Project 7 convertible. Top 10 car, finishing seventh last season. 22 career wins. Finished second in his preliminary round race. Oh, he is gonna give it to the Escort, I'm sure. But look at this. Capri and Escort, side by side. We all know there's a rivalry between these two cars. The uh, rivalry started last week. One point up for the Escort. Because the... He beat him. He beat him well. Let's see if he can do it again. It's the Jaguar and Capri head to head on the inside. Ooh, Escort's coming up fast. Jaguar is going to take the line first. And yes, it was Escort. Escort second, Capri third. Wow. Oh yeah, all right. The Jaguar gave it to the Escort. He, he beat him. Wow, what a good start for him. And with the battle of the Escort and the Capri, or the Capri almost got there, right? At, he led him most of the way. It's just on the line. Escort would not give up that win. <laughs> or give up that second place. Okay, this championship race of Meet 2 Season 8 is a strange one. Even though we do have 73 career wins between these five don't normally see these guys together and we've only got one top five one top ten car in that's the lane one corvette grand sport currently sitting in second he'll take first place after this meet for sure he is a raging hot favorite he is the only car on this on this track today that has won a championship three in fact and he came second Last meet to the 350Z, so he is a runaway favorite. Everyone's putting their house on him. Lane two, we have the 2007 Subaru Impreza Police Special. Uh, he doesn't get this championship race often, so I, just, I got no idea how he's going to go. It's a day for upsets, so you never know. Lane three, his first championship meet. 
race ever. It's the 70 Ford Escort. Let's see if his luck can continue. And this is the guy in lane four. I said, I'm going to put all my money on after beating the top two cars to get here. The Datsun 510 wagon. He's never, never won a championship meet, ever. But he brings up his 20 and brings up his legendary status. Oh, the fates. Oh, a Disney story if he can go through and win today. And lane five, the Jaguar F-Type Project 7 convertible, 23 career wins. He also has never won a championship race ever after 20 tries, 23 tries. Mm, mm, mm. Let's find out who wins meet two. Oh my god, what the hell? The escort went vertical, what the hell? Oh, the Datsun and Jaguar head to head. Whoa, we've got another photo finish here. Look at poor old escort, wow. It was a Datsun, the Datsun wins, wow.